Hello, welcome back to this Pokemon Uranium playthrough. I'm MBV3. You remember from, from the last episode, I just got my starter Pokemon, which was Orchinx, the Grass Steel type. And now I'm going to continue on, find out what to do next. But I need to go get my rival. Also, talk to my grandma, or auntie, rather. I think it's just in my house. I wanted to see my Pokemon, so let's go have a chat. Oh honey, you came back to say goodbye. How sweet. Is that your Pokemon? What's it called? Orchinx? So cute. Come back when you need a rest, or if you want to. You me your old aunt. Okay, I need to find Theo's house. There's one of the ones down here that I didn't go in. Listen, have you heard of the new video game? It's called Pokemon Red version. How <laughs> cute. Okay. I bought my son the, the new video game all the children playing these days, but he won't go down even for a second. Don't blame him. Uh, must be somehow, I suppose, this one's larger than the others. <laughs> yep, there he is. Oh, he's run off. What did you say to my son? He ran upstairs crying and locked the door behind him. Don't tell you what's wrong or come downstairs. I swear, if you did anything to hurt him, I'd beat his ass in a purple map. That's how it is. You got the weakest starter and you beat him in battle. Let's see, that explains it. Last lesson to be sure, losing as much part of being a trainer is winning. He had his heart set on this day being perfect, so losing right off the bat is somewhat of a shock. Still, crying won't solve every, anything, and that's something he has to learn. I wonder what happened if I actually lost the battle. <laughs> Theo, come downstairs right now, young man. Careful. Can't cry every time you lose a battle, that's just part of being a trainer. There, Nathan got the better starter than me. Now I'm never gonna win. Catch more Pokemon to balance out your team's weaknesses. Besides, all race Pokemon still win, even though disadvantaged. No sense giving up before you even begin. I fear I won't always be around to pick up, pick you up. When you are feeling down, try and be strong for yourself, okay? Nathan, please be patient with my son. He looks up to you, you know. I nearly forgot. Fia, I have... Nathan, I have something for both of you. Present? Exactly. Nathan, your father, Kellen, sent me these and told me to give them to you both when you begin your journeys. Oh, come on, you saw. Pokepad. What's that? It's a high-tech device that indispensable Pokemon trainers. Plays music, includes a map of the region, and most importantly, contains a phone to allow you to stay in touch with each other and other trainers. I got the red one, it's cooler than yours. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm gonna go meet the professor by the edge of town. I'll be the first to catch a Pokemon. Bye, Dad. Keep up, Nathan. Talk about dramatic turnaround. He always bounces back quickly. Nathan, you don't want to keep the professor waiting. So you should get moving too. I'm going to see you or Theo again for some time. Yeah, I'm starting a new job soon. I'm supervising construction of a new power plant, Epsilon. So I'll see you there in time. After all, it's the last place Lucille has ever seen. Interesting. Best of luck in your journey, Nathan. Yeah, let's have a look at this Pokepad. Or Pokepod, sorry. Ah, oh, so it's basically Poke Gear. Route 3 was to the right, so I'm guessing Route 1 is over here. Yep. Hey there, Nathan. Now that you and Theo are here, it's time to begin your first lesson as a Pokemon trainer and a field reset jade. Now watch closely. Wild Pokemon, as you probably already know, inhabit the tall grass, but that's not the only place you can find them in caves, water, and even cities if you know where to look. Still, tall grass is going to be your best bet for finding new Pokemon. The wild chin monk. They're very common around here. It hasn't noticed me yet, so now's my chance. Go Raptorch. Little guy was the other starter Pokemon you received. Could have received. 
Take a shine to me, and I rather like him, so I'm gonna keep it. Now the next step is so we can scrap toys. You scratch. It's quite an interesting way of doing it. Rather than actually going into a battle. And that's weakened. It's my chance. Pokeball, go. He cheated. Did he even shake? And that's how it's done. Now, Chi and Monk are fairly easy, but you're sure to encounter Pokemon that are a lot tougher to capture. Those you might need to inflict them with a status effect, or use a special Pokeball. I'm sure you'll get the hang of it before too long. Nathan Theo, these are for you. Pokedex. Encyclopedia that automatically updates itself whenever you encounter or catch a new Pokemon. It's very important for my research to make sure to fill it out as much as possible. Also, I want you to have these. Receive Pokeballs. Pokeballs are necessary to catch a Pokemon. Of course. What's that thing the kids always say? Gotta catch them all. If you run out, you can pick some more up at any Pokemon. Moki Town doesn't have one of these, but there's one in Kevlar Town on the other side of Route 1. So with that said, your lesson's now over. Ah, but you two have Pokepads, don't you? Here, don't you can put my number. You can give me a call anytime, and I'll take a look at how your Pokedex is coming along. If you do a good job collecting many different kinds of Pokemon, I might even have special rewards for you. With that said, I'm going back to my lab. Best of luck on your journey, both of you. Oh, there we go. I don't care that you've got the strongest starter. I'm still going to be the best trainer ever. I'll catch tons of Pokemon and will win every battle. Just you wait and see. Okay, I have Pokedex. Check out Ortix. Metal plates under its fur protect it from harm. It replenishes its energy by basking in the sun. Ayan Red. Oh, yes, yeah, the town uh, map. Side path. Have the town there. Passage cave. No, no touch city. That's, that is that route two, isn't it? Oh, and look. Three series way. The Royal Town. Have one school. Bar grassland. Route four. Route ten. Beautiful forest. What is that? What that is? There as well. Amatree Town, where are those berry trees? Oh, that branches off, so I guess it's bigger than this. Comet Cave, Tancoon Way, Rochevale Town, Professor Cypress Labs. Oh, so there's two professors in this game. Okay. The Har Hills, Fire Valley, that sounds cool. And all sheets. Vinoville Lake. Vinoville Town. Nature Preserve. Vegan Town. The Tinkerer's Workshop. Victory Road. Championship Site. And up here, Ball Beach City. I guess that's where it was. I guess the rest of it opens up when I get that. Okay, let's continue on and get our first Pokemon. Second, even. Burby appears. Okay, new scratch. 
I don't know if that <laughs> design on its chest kind of looks like a mouth. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Scratch and it doesn't crit. This flash already. Okay, and pull it. Bye, cool. Sweet. We caught a new partner, Burby. I'm guessing, yeah, normal fly, it's going to be this region's bird Pokemon. Sweet, still get experience like an X and Y plot. Capturing Pokemon. Our Orchard is now level 6. So it's down here. Actual trainer. You're a new trainer, huh? I just started too. Last Lynette. Went out. Alton. Oh, that's the cute cat bird thing. Ah, oh, cool. Still typing down to it out. Got that potion if I need it. Definitely doing a lot more damage. Should be okay. Since it doesn't get crit. Oh, we were speed guard. Oh, and it's taken down. Sweet. Anyone can be a trainer, but some people definitely seem more suited to it than others, don't you think? Looks like you got a head start on me. Okay, let's go back to heal that. Defense, special attack, and speed IVs, but they're not so good attack ones. Big pecs. Gust and flash. The odd for. I just got this new Pokemon and I want to see how it fares. Are these are all the kids from town who are already out starting. <laughs> School kid Taff for that battle. And we have a Chinimonk. This sort of chipmunk squirrel thing. Uh, flash. Yeah, 
take another hit because it did 9 damage. Switch up to Orchinx. Flash paid off. Now you scratch. Oh sweet, steel type coming in handy. And the flash again. Maybe one more hit, definitely two will go down. Crick, as it means a lot when it's not that HP. Go back to Burby. Struggle with this one, I think I need to use a potion. Okay, there's a bit of four, that's not too bad. Okay. And that would be level 4. And then ground. And all things are almost level 7. It's not as strong as I hope. You're a natural battle, Nathan. Well, I'll keep trying. I'm over here. Antidote. I'm a fisherman, and these ponds next to my house have a wide variety of Pokemon. If you prove you're strong, I may give you my old fishing rod. First, you'll need to defeat Mark Maria. Now touch. Now talk. I don't know how to understand. But he's gym leader. Good living between Kevlar and Moki Town. Okay, so is Maria the first gym leader or not? It'll be a while before we get the rod. Okay, I'm going to call that an episode here. I'm going to do some grinding off screen to get the Furby and Autrinx up a few levels. Now, four and six, we'll try and get at least both of them to level seven. So, if you, thank you for watching if you've watched all the way through, and I'll see you next time on part three.